Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So these nails, um, I did I did this hand yesterday and someone had asked to post a video if I had one. So I'm going to go ahead and make a video. So I have a water marble plus stamping. I have on my nails already a coat of white. And then for the background I'm going to be using um, white, gray, and black. Um, the white I have is Orly White Tips and this is just room temperature water. I have Simple Colors Cool Gray, Essie's Power Clutch, Color Club Beyond which is a hollow, and the black is Black Sheep by Jolie G. I'll have all the colors listed down below. And if I didn't mention already, this is room temperature water. This is the water that I did my nails with yesterday. And then the cup that I have is just a yogurt cup. Okay, and then I'm going to take my needle, which I feel that it's the smallest and it gets it pretty good. I'm going to go from the center out and center out, and that kind of anchors it. And then from the top, from side to side. You could stop there, or just keep going. I like just to keep going. Um, and then I have a Q-tip which I use to clean up with. So I'm gonna find where I would like the design. And then I'm gonna blow on the surface to dry the polish faster so it cleans up. Okay, now I do have air bubbles on both sides. Okay, so what I do to fix that is I pull it out slowly until they pop. And then I dunk it back in and clean up. And then there's one more, it didn't pop. So I pull it out until it pops. Okay, that one's not going to pop, but usually, oh, there it goes. Okay, so I usually put tape around my nails, but this time I didn't. But before it dries, oops, I just messed that up. Okay, so before it dries, I like to get most of it. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and fix that with just painting on the colors that I messed up. And then I'll meet you back with the stamping. Okay, so here I have the Moe London Pro Collection XL3 plate. And this design I'll be using right here. Okay, the stamping polishes I have that I'll be using are from Mundo de Unis, um, Neon Pink, Neon Orange, Neon Yellow, Turquoise, and Fuchsia. Okay, so I'm going to place the colors around the petal of the flower. And since these are etched really nice um, and this polish is thick, it tends to stay where you put it. Now these polishes go, a little bit goes a long way. And the key to doing this is you want to only scrape it once. If you scrape it twice, the colors will blend.
Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and clean that up and top coat. And the top coat I'm using is Chef Vite. Okay, now I, I do have a picture of these on my Instagram, and I'll be posting these ones too. Um, so if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, and please subscribe to see more, and comment and let me know what you think. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.